and Logan. And we're going to be riding rad power bikes and a few other things. Uh, Logan, how do you want to start this? Let's just ride around. We're just going to be riding our bikes, maybe hoverboards, scooters. We're going to be riding with Logan, which is back there. And uh, we'll be riding a one-wheel pint, so I'll make a review on that too. This is kind of be going to be a everything video. Jumps, cool. All right, we're gonna ride to the two ponds. Two ponds or one pond, Logan? All right, we're gonna ride to the two ponds, guys. And then when we get back, uh, well, maybe I'll, I'll stop it. And then I'll do a few other videos. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Logan, how is that rad mini? Pretty good for, for the size. So, would you, how would you rate this bike on a scale of 1 to 10? Mm, probably a 7. 7? And why do you rate it a 7 instead of a 10? Just because it doesn't have the big enough, for me, it doesn't have big enough tires. Big enough tires? And the shocks. Yep, they are a little bit short. So, what would you rather have, that one or that one? The, the Rad Rover yeah, or the, the Rad, Rad Mini? Rad Rover. Alright, and why? It's just got bigger tires, better suspension. Just more somewhat, your size? Somewhat bigger battery. Yeah, well. yeah. So, what would you rate this one? Probably a 9. Why 9 and not a 10? Is there anything that's missing? Speed. Speed? Yeah. I like it. 20? Yeah. Wow. Okay. Alright, let's go. Alright, you ready, Logan?
let Logan go for a minute. I'm gonna switch bikes with him. Alright, Logan. Nice. Logan's pretty good at jumping this. So that's our uh, old deal right there. I'm gonna hand this GoPro over to you so you can record me jumping. And I want the Rad Mini. Here you go. Just record me jumping and stuff. So I like the Rad Rover better than the Rad Mini on jumping. Just cause the tires are bigger. So I feel more comfortable and it seems like it has more control. comfortable on this. This is my bike, so by the way, I have 249 miles on it. No problems at all. So, it's been a great bike for that many. Logan, you rode this probably 50, maybe 15 miles Yeah. throughout this. Review it. Um, I, for me, the steering feels a little wonky because it's got some On which one? small tires. Well, this is the Rad Mini. Yeah, the Rad Mini. Yeah. Because it has two long handlebars and one small tire. Uh, and it also does that, so it can be a little bit wiggly, too. But the Rad Mini folds up into a compact size, so that's why it does that. Now, would you buy this bike for $1,800? Or, uh, I fourteen hundred. Red mini. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Would you buy the Rad Rover for one thousand six hundred dollars? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Now, would you rather have that than a one wheel XR? XR, I'd prefer an XR. And why? jumps that thing pretty quick. Here we go. Boom. Now I know it's not a real jump, guys, but it's all we have, so I don't know. I personally have the Rad Rover too. Just oh, here we go. Now these bikes are not made for this. Just so you know. They're meant for to be a smooth pavement princess. But I would also have the Rad Rover. I think it's just a better bike. Um, you can do more with it. It has better clearance. It doesn't have a bigger battery like uh, Logan said, but he's new to all this stuff, so. Let's see. Come on, Logan, you gonna jump? See how much air he gets. Oh, nice. He went full send on that one. Alright. 
I'm gonna ride the Rad Rover now, so Lo I'm gonna turn this over to Logan. All right, Logan, I'm gonna ride the Rad Rover, and I'm gonna have you record it for him. Okay. Why you got a rock? You're weird. Let's go, boys. As you saw, it does in the video. It does look like the Rad Rover has more control, and I really do think it does. It's just the tire size, really. I just don't like the small tires of the Rad Rover of the Rad Mini. Mini. 